All right, all right, all right. Um, I got inspired to do this idea, um, talking to my homies on my Discord. So we're gonna do it right now. And this is my top 15 favorite skins of all time. Now, what I decided to do is I base it on my main. So I have four characters that I main this game, so I'll show you. My four mains, uh, if we're going by DPS, is Sojourn and Echo, and in support is uh, Anna and Iari. So, let's get started. We're not gonna bullshit, we're not gonna waste any time. So, number 15. Number 15 is the epic skin, uh, Firefighter. I feel like this skin, and as y'all know with a lot of Sojourn skins, a lot of them are basically like her default skin, but they just change a little this, a little that. But her default skin is just that good to me. So this skin grew on me. I think this is a fan of that skin and you know, Team Thick, all day Team Thick. I think she's still one of the thickest skins I've seen in, in the game, especially a shooting game. So praise be. So yeah, number 15 in my top 15 list, Firefire. I think this skin is very, very much slept on and it's an excellent skin. I love the color tone with it. Just great. Number 14 is for Anna. It's a, a combination of two skins because one of them is a reskin. And that's going to be the Snow Owl and the Night Owl. I think these two skins are fantastic. I remember when this came out with Wonderland a couple years ago, Overwatch 1. And then they did a reskin near the end of it. Just, just look at the details, bro. Like Night Owl, Snow Owl. Like, what's still left to say, bro? Usually I'm not the biggest fan of somebody's face cover, but. This one, it's like, just, it's just fire, bro. That's not love to say about this, bro. Now, number 13, going back to Sojourn. Uh, I think I have all her skins, by the way, for Sojourn. Like, I am a big Sojourn fan. Going to number 13, it's going to be her Cyber Detective skin. This skin, I don't care anyone say this. This is the Freaky Link skin. Like, this skin is fire, bro. You know, you got the detective hat, kind of give you some Michael Jackson vibes. Like, come on, bro. Like, we know. We know. You know what I mean? We're going to stop this case. we going to stop this case. And I think this is an excellent skin. Like, I I remember when it first came out, I had to get the skin. So, number 13 is definitely going to be the Sojourn Cyber Detective skin. I think it's a fantastic skin. Just the other skin is a little more better for her, but still a great skin. It's actually one of the few skins you actually wear in sunglasses, too, which I thought that was a treat. Alright, number 12, we're going to Echo now. This is when they start doing the little um, Guardians of the Galaxy or Star Wars style theme. And um, I forgot I got this skin. I Do I have this skin? Before? Yeah, yeah, I do have this skin. I gotta, I gotta look into this skin, but it's not a one. But I gotta look into it more. I just haven't used it yet. And it's gonna be the automation skin. I think this is one of her most fire skin that kind of feels like the basic default skin, but they just took it to the next level. And it's probably one of the most human-like skins she has. Like, this one was, was top-notch. I was very impressed with this skin. They did the face right, everything is just fire. The, the silver and gold, fire. Um, but yeah, um, that's gonna be for that one. The automation, I call it Star Wars skin. Number 11, right above it, good and evil. My god, I got this skin so late, but when it came out in Overwatch 1 near the end, oh my god, this the skin is so detailed. This was in the Overwatch Elite skin, so you know they were showing out in this skin. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Like, this skin is just elegant, beautiful, just everything right, good and evil. We all have a good and evil side in us, so I respect that for that reason. So, now we are in the top 10. And we're going back to Anna. Anna's young Anna skin and her horror skin. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, give me a moment, please. I remember right. It is like you know we got the horror skin and and Captain Amari. First of all, it's young Anna. Like, come on, bro. It's young Anna. This skin is fire. Like, come on, bro. Like, come on, bro. Kind of like the Mega Man, but with the snipers to a, to a gun. Well, down the horse, you can't go wrong. Young Anna all day, bro. Anna was really the first character I main in Overwatch, so I love this kid since day one. 
I love this game from day one. So this is basically like recos. I'm just gonna put them all as one. All right. Now number nine. Now I use this skin for a hot minute for Anna, and it is the sniper skin. This skin right here is phenomenal. Just the layers, the details, everything about it is just phenomenal about it. I I, I love the skin. You can never go wrong. I even like how it looks. I, I like it has like a little silencer for the sniper thing. I think that's so cool. Another young Anna skin. You can't go wrong. Just just a phenomenal skin. Just phenomenal for number nine. And you were like, how you top that? Number eight. The Magneto skin, bro. Like, come on, bro. Like, anytime it's in the Obar sleeve, they're about to show out, bro. Like, look at this, bro. I, I feel bad I slept on the skin for a long time. And I finally got it, and I am so glad I did. Like, this skin is phenomenal. With the eye thing on the left side, give me that little Magneto vibes. Everything they did, it just, it's just fantastic. I love the little knife up there that will never use, but it's so cool that it has it. Like, just phenomenal. I love this game. So now, we the top seven. Number seven might catch y'all off guard, and I, I have no regrets for it. But, number seven is going to be Iari's default skin. Yes, her default skin. I love this default. I love the color combination with the blue, yellow, and red with the white and black and gold. It's just so detailed. Like she's she's one of the few people that have amazing default skins. And this one, I just love it. I love her default skin. I know because I've gone for the other skins she has. But this one, like, it's so good that any other color with it works great with it. I knew more kind of has that same thing too, where I, I just really love this default skin. I think they just knocked out the park. This is really good and it's really um detailed so now top six we're going back to baby cake sojourn excuse me here we go she's a runner she's a track star I right, come on bro runner when this came out i had to get it when she first came out with this skin is when her default skin i had to get it bro this skin is so great so cool just left the gym just so normal but just it's just like again she's so just one of those person where either you love her skins or you hate her skins it's one of the two and i fucking love her skins like using the default skin change the color thing just add a little extra it's giving me some like 80s 90s flair like i i, I love the skin bro you just never go wrong with the skin i, I really enjoy it now we're on the top five Going back to Yari, we're gonna do the Daybreak and the Sundown skin. I'm, I'm just gonna call them the same skin. They're basically the same. I think people really sleep on this skin. I really do. I think this skin is so detailed. I love the mask, I love the hat. You know, I mean, everything about it. It's just, it's so detailed. It's so beautiful to me. Like, like a knight in shining armor it's just amazing like I, I i truly enjoy these skins you know because i used to random for favorites so when i get these i get excited and just just marvel at it man it's like a night for the sun i bought a, a night for the sun and it's, it's incredible to me i i freaking love this skin for that reason all right top four. Oh man the top four going back to sojourn and yeah, we're gonna do i call the cami skin let me show y'all i call this skin the cami skin infinite admiral my god just again using the default skin but just changing this and that like if it ain't broke don't fix it bro like are you serious bro with the cami style hat on the beretta got the marks from the, the war like skin is phenomenal bro i know music is phenomenal a lot but that's the only way i can think of right now i i really love the details at first i thought i was not gonna like it because of the scars but it makes sense if you are an admiral all the wars you've been through you're gonna be through some fights and i think this is a great skin for her all right guys we are now in the top three 
we're in the top three now of my list. It's just my versus being of my favorite skins. Number three. This was a skin that actually was bought with my um, Lexi coin, so I appreciate it more because of it. It's the Iari Amethyst skin. Just, just look at the skin, bro. This is how good her default is. Her default skin is so good they can just change the color of it. And just just look at it, man. Just just look at the detail, bro. Like this is just it was showing out, bro. This this it'll be tough to top this skin to me for ERA. I think this is her best ERA skin in my personal opinion. The skin is a dream. It it, it takes me to another world. Just the hair color and everything. I, I love it. The, the 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 purple, blue, yellow, white, the gold. It's just I love it. I just, just bask in the glory. Number three. Now we on the top two, and I ain't gonna lie. The top two skins, in my personal opinion, because they're both gonna be soldier skins, right? Both of these skins, I, I it, it'll be hard to top. Anytime they do a mythic skin for soldier, it's gonna be hard. I don't think any mythic for soldier will top these two skins. So, without further ado, this skin really just came out, and it just it's just shoulder raise right there. Formal wear sojourn. Number two, just bask in his glory. Just bask in his glory. Got the hair done. Got the black with the white. It's like simple but yet elegant. I I love the simplicity of it, but I also love the advancements of it. The shoe game sick. Got the hoverboard things just in case. Phenomenal skin, like I'm shedding a tear. How great this skin is! Just amazing skin. That's my number two. Now, this number one skin it should be obvious what it is. This skin made me mad how much I, how much I paid for it, but I'm glad I still did it because I felt like there's none that was gonna ever top this skin to me. My number one favorite skin, Water Warrior. Like. Come on, man. Like, just just bask in the glory. Like, oh, sorry. Let me go. But yeah, actually, hold on a second. Let me, let's, let's just look at the highlights with this, man. Like, look at that. Like, look at the details, man. Like, look at this. If this ain't a mythic, I don't know what to tell you. Like, the only thing that could top this is they ever did a soldier skin with no body parts. I will buy it without digging. It. Take my money. This is my favorite skin of all time. I low-key wish they did like a her regular skin version of this, but I guess it's Water Warrior, so it makes sense. I wish it was the other day before like Ocean Goddess. I really do, but it is what it is. Skin is amazing. And, um, this is my top five favorite skins for or watch two based on the characters I made. I hope y'all enjoyed this. I really do. And I hope y'all have a wonderful day.